earlier this year, I did a series of Dr. Reverend Do You Wrong. The biography or the lifestyle of a crooked black Negro preacher. And I've been in black churches all of my life. I assume that you have to, whether you Baptist or Church of God in Christ. And I've seen anything in churches from church fights, niggas embezzling money, niggas catching the Holy Ghost, niggas getting exposed, niggas getting caught having sex in church vans. I've seen it all. But how these things start and how beefs get started in church got to do with preachers fucking on these niggas' wives. And typically, this is instigated by the women in these churches. Now, the reason why I'm saying this is that the women always get off. The women never lose in these situations. The women, when they fuck the preacher, the best thing that happens, the preacher leaves his wife to marry her. Or if she gets caught, she goes and cries to the church and say the pastor seduced him. They forgive her, get rid of the preacher. So she ain't got nothing to lose. And the nigga that she was with, she didn't want to be with him. No way. So if the woman gets to sleep with the pastor, it's always a good thing. Let me tell you why. The nigga that she is dealing with in these churches, because these women, usually in these churches, they love these preachers. This is why some of you niggas' wives is out here making peach cobbler for the preacher. She's the announcement clerk. She's singing an alto off key in the, the women's choir on first Sunday. She's out volunteering and dealing with children's church, children's choir, all this shit. Black history plays. See, this is what they're doing. But the problem is she's married to a simp. It's Leroy the drummer. He plays off beat. He's 72 years old on the drums. And the drums is a young nigga sport in church. He boom, that, boom, that, boom. Jesus is on the man. Boom. You know, bless his heart. He off beat, though. Or there's Earl the Usher. Nigga got the Michael Jackson thriller white gloves on. You're trying to get there. The pastor is praying or preaching. He won't let you in the church. Stay, stay out there, boy. Stay out there. You know, that's how he is. During the offering and shit, he he watching and shit, making sure you ain't still at, the, at that basket. He looking right at you all the time. During the communion and during the uh, 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 altar call, he making sure the kids ain't running around fucking up. That's that's the usher. She married to him, or she's married to Deacon Little John, who's a complete simp and does everything. That she says. Now, on paper, the dude is good. He got a good job. He's been providing. He's been in the community. But it ain't Reverend Do You Wrong with them gold glasses and that Jerry Curl and receding hairline and the high the Lord. See, she loves that. Now, your question for me right now is Oshay, how do I know who the pastor is sleeping with in the church? I'm glad you asked this question, nigga. This is a good question. You're very smart. How you can tell one way the woman who always is in the amen corner. That's right, pastor. Hallelujah. Woo! This is the one. It went all that hooping and hollering. Ah, and she, ah, oh, Jesus. This is the one that want to get fucked. She's running around the church, titties bouncing everywhere. She's trying to get trying to get seen. She's falling out. She wants the preacher to notice her. Now, if the woman is good looking, Reverend Do You Wrong already notices her. Because see, Reverend Do You Wrong just don't fuck on good looking women. He fucks on dimes, fat broads, old broads. But see, if they're not as cute, they have to put Reverend Do You Wrong in compromising positions. Now, let's talk about such a compromising position. Now, because Elroy the Usher or you know Lil Leviticus on the drums or Earl, you know, or, 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 or Leroy the, the Little John, Dick and Little John, these are the guys she don't want. She gonna start having problems in this house. 
sex going to stop? Because again, she wants to be first lady. She feels that she's done herself a disservice. She's jealous of the pastor's wife. She want to be that pastor's wife. She want to be getting the glory. But she's going to tell her husband, you know, baby, we need to see pastor and have him consult us about our relationship because we are really not having the same fire that we did when we first met. So let's talk to the pastor, see what he can do. Now the, 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 the dude is ain't nothing wrong with him. He like, well, baby, we have no, baby, we need to talk to the pastor. Why don't you ask the pastor if we can have a conversation with him? So now Dick and little John or little Leroy, this is embarrassing for him because he has to go and ask Reverend do you wrong. Hey, pastor, you know, I was wondering if you will give me some consultation with me and my wife. Now, as a paying tither at Mount Negro Baptist Church, the pastor is going to say, oh, OK, brother, I'll consult with you and your wife. But automatically he's going to think, nigga, you can't control your bitch. Why do you need me to consult your wife? Nigga, don't you know I'm Reverend Do You Wrong? I'm fucking everybody in the church. Now, everybody knows that Reverend Do You Wrong has been at Motel 5.5 fucking everybody. Everybody knows this. But he has already let Reverend Do You Wrong know that he don't have no control over his home. So Reverend Do You Wrong is thinking, man, who your wife again? Sister Lokeisha? This is the same hoe that every time I'm preaching in church, she's running around. She's all glory, all falling all on the floor. Now, she did give me, I'm thinking, I'm, I'm preaching like Reverend Do You Wrong now. She's thinking like Reverend Do You Wrong. She did give me an extra long hug last Sunday. Titties was all on my shoulder and everything like that. I didn't think nothing of it. Now, this is somebody he probably ain't that attracted to. But since she's throwing the pussy at me, I might as well see what's going on with it. So, here come the pastoral consultation meet up on a saturday they come to the church she got low cleavage dress on and here she's complaining to reverend do you wrong in front of her husband about how her husband is not making her happy in the marriage we just not doing everything we used to do we not having fun like we used to do pastor i don't know what to do pastor sitting now looking at them titties he didn't know them titties was that big in that dress. He not really listened to what the fuck she talking about. Titties is on his mind. Now, this nigga simp that's in the church, he don't really understand that Reverend Do You Wrong understands that the brawl is really choosing up on the pastor because the pastor has to give him advice. On how to treat the woman. Now, of course, Reverend Do You Wrong is a pimp. He's a player, so he understands what to tell the man. This is how you need to check your home. Now, shout out to Simple to P. And I have another brother, you know, Alan Roger Curry, because they told me things like this in the past about how they deal with clients. If a man sees you, or a woman sees you, so weak that another man is instructing you how to treat your wife in front of her she is going to automatically think why am i giving the pussy to you i need to give it to him and so raven do you wrong knows that as you are giving him the game on how to deal with this hoe she is getting turned on coochie getting moist right in the pastoral office now Reverend, do you wrong? What do you think about your wife but because you have your simp and you have came to him to consult with him now all of a sudden she gonna give him the direct number to well pastor here's my phone number and here's my husband's number this is how it works now all of a sudden pastor is not calling he might call the husband a few times hey man how's your how's the thing working with your wife all oh, pastor's going good but then he calls the wife separately the next day i just called this is pastor reverend do you wrong call and say how you doing baby Oh, Pastor, I'm doing pretty good. All right, I just want to let you know this. Next thing you know, they text and good morning all the time. This is this starts off slow. Next thing, she sends a picture. Pastor, how do I look in this dress? Nothing but titties. Then, all of a sudden, she calls and says, Pastor, can you come pray for me? At 12.06 a.m. 
Where's your husband at? Oh, he's gone for the weekend. Open up the door, butt naked, Reverend Do You Wrongus, on your wife. Then here comes the ultimatum. You need to leave your wife or I'm going to tell the church that you've been fucking me. And when he doesn't, that's when she tells the church and Reverend Do You Wrong gets kicked out the church and everybody forgives her. You see, this how it starts. And then that's how church splits happen. Niggas start fighting in churches then Reverend Do You Wrong go start a new church all this shit. But it all starts behind these consultations and how they do it is they bring the husband in the church and say I have marriage problems that's one way they do it those who are married and see I gotta tell you niggas about these preachers if you ever go to one of these niggas about a consultation about your goddamn wife or your girlfriend or any kind of marriage counselor, you are stupid. Because if your wife looks any type of decent, she ain't even got to look decent. If she got ass or breasts, and if he is anywhere turned on that by her, he gonna hit that. Because he already is what she would consider a top nigga. She's preaching and hooping and hollering to the, to the, to the broad every Sunday. And watch how she acts. If she's not a, a shouter, she might be sitting there doing this. If she's crying, tears coming down her eyes, if she's doing this, making that face, it's over, nigga. You don't want that nigga near your wife or your girlfriend. If she start getting involved in these extra ministries, cooking, cleaning, helping the poor, she not doing this shit because she loves Jesus. She doing this shit because she want to impress this nigga. And you ain't the nigga. You play the drums. You clean. You the assistant baptism cleaner. You uh, 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 iron the choir robes. You are the church van driver. Nigga, you don't have enough juice for her. She trying to come up in Jesus name. And you ain't even a 12 of the disciples. You the nigga that fixed the, uh, the sandals for the disciples to her. You, you, you the nigga like Zacchaeus. You too short. You in the tree somewhere. You you not even you 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 not even a, a a character in the biblical Bible to her, and yet you go ask this nigga, can you consult her? While she's sending signals, talking about pastor, come get this ass. Then you want to get mad and go shoot the preacher. Then you want to get mad so you don't want to go to church no more. But at the end of the day, if your game was tight, she would never go ask the preacher. No way. I just want to drop this off, y'all. So, again, thank you niggas for watching. Sign up for me to uh, 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 subscribe at the bell. Now, for those of you who want to support me on Patreon, not support me, but support NegroManusford.com. It's $5 a month. I got some extra good content on there. Um, I have NegroManusford.com. We currently have the moderator awards. Go vote for your favorite moderators on my channels. And, um, you know, we're really doing a great thing for black men. We have the United Kingdom Manosphere black manosphere a podcast today so brothers support brothers that are trying to bring black men together we do that just five dollars a month i know you niggas got it because you've been at the strip club all night not all night long and you ain't got no ass yet so five dollars a month brothers i appreciate you subscribe at the bell and as you niggas know the buffoonery of reverend dr do you wrong remains an all-time high i'm out